Today, we have some old skis and this old bike, and we're gonna be making a ski bike. So the plan for this project seems pretty easy. We take an old bike, remove the tires, and replace them with skis. One goal that we have with making this bike is to spend a minimal amount of money. And when I mean minimal, I mean like less than 10 bucks. We'll get more into the cost side of things later in this video, but now that you guys have a basic idea of what we're doing, we can start building this bike. We had to start off by removing the chain ring because when the bike stood up, there wasn't enough clearance and it dug into the ground. Surprisingly, removing this chain ring was actually the thing that took the longest during this project. Because we don't have a crank puller, we had to saw and bend one part of the ring off at a time until the entire ring broke off. Other than that, this step went without any issues. Well, for the most part. Oh my god, it's smoking. With the chain ring out of the way now, we could get to the more interesting stuff, which started with cutting the skis to length. Now that the skis were the right length, we had to figure out how to attach them. Now we were having a hard time trying to figure out how to attach the skis to the frame, but then I remembered, we have duct tape. So we definitely did not end up using duct tape, but instead used old skateboard trucks. So the plan is to have it rigged up like this, with the truck on top of the ski and the bike frame connected to the truck. So this bike is now finished, and I'd be lying if I didn't say, it looks pretty darn schmexy. So much so that before we ride it, I think we just need to stare at it. Possibly the best part about this bike is that it only cost us 4 bucks to make. We already own the old bike frame and we were able to purchase the skis for $4. Now we're gonna load it up in the truck and take it to some snow hills. So we're out here at the hills and it's colder than an ice cube in Antarctica right now. So I'm gonna do something a little unprecedented. Whoa. Now I know what you're saying. This kid's off his rocker. He looks like a lunatic. And that's where I say you're 100% correct. But it's cold out and I gotta keep the melon in one piece. So we're just gonna do this for safety reasons. This is a lot scarier when you're up here on the top of the hill. All right, here we go. Ready? Oh, oh, You okay? Yeah. All right. This thing is hard to steer, dude. Keep doing this. Sure, we can go somewhere else. Riding this ski bike was quite the learning experience. The back tended to slide out, which made it really hard to steer. Riding down on sleds trying to film the ski bike also ended up being quite the learning experience. We started 
would get the hang of it though, which made it really fun. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Doing this will make it possible for us to give you guys more quality content. And until next time, be sure to turn up the rad factor. <laughs> oh my gosh. No screw. That is helpful actually, because I can just screw yeah. a peg right on and Oh my.